Hi, this is the Aaron Schwartz channel. I want to explain to you, if you've seen me on Twitter or X, say something like, I hate Vladimir Putin, or I pronounce a curse over Russia or the Russian military, I want you to understand why. They're murdering children. They're bombing neighborhoods and houses like the one you're in. They're killing innocent people. Vladimir Putin is ordering the Russian military to murder people like you. Regular people who have done nothing wrong, who are just innocent, regular people trying to live their lives, okay? That's why I'm frustrated with the war in the Ukraine. And I'm particularly upset with the 20 to 30 year old young people in Kiev who could, they speak the same language, who could go help the people on the front line. I'm almost to the point of moving to the Ukraine to help because they won't. How embarrassing, it's shameful. If you're watching this and you're a young person in the Ukraine, shame on you. You need to go help the soldiers on the front line protect your country. That is abysmal for you to allow your fathers, your cousins, your brothers, and your sisters, there's women too, to allow your neighbors and family to sacrifice their lives, having their limbs blown off by shrapnel so that you can screw off going to parties drinking alcohol in the capital, in Kiev. You are half of the problem. And if you're a Russian person watching this, Vladimir Putin's TV broadcasts are absolute bull. They are factually inaccurate lies. The Ukrainian military is only protecting the Ukrainian national space, okay? The Russian military is invading, and they're not just bombing and shelling and shooting howitzers and dropping bombs and shooting surface-to-air missiles. They're not just shooting machine guns at military targets. That's called honorable warfare. They're engaged in immoral, satanic, evil warfare, shooting military weapons at civilians. That's as warped and sick as what the Chinese CCP military did during the Tiananmen Square incident in 1989, known as the June 4th incident. And I'll tell you what, Vladimir Putin and Xi Jinping, or whatever the premier of the CCP's name is, because I don't speak Chinese, however you say his Xi's name, yeah, they're despots like Adolf Hitler. Let me make myself abundantly clear. Vladimir Putin and Donald Trump have been friends for a long time. They're narcissistic, evil wackos. And if you elect Donald Trump again, you're voting for Vladimir Putin indirectly because they've been tightly affiliated. You know, people become like who they spend time with. Will you tell me, what were they doing at Jeffrey Epstein's Island 27 different times? Because I watched those three documentary films about it too, with Prince Andrew and the rest of the diplomats, including the Clintons. I know exactly what they were doing there, and I'm not going to say it because it's disgusting, and we're not even supposed to utter the things that some people do in private, okay? So that's what this video is about. It's about the war in the Ukraine being immoral and unethical and disgusting, and why all the Western powers need to help the Ukraine. And if you're a Ukrainian young person, you have a duty and obligation to go help the people who are fighting to protect your country.